Good day kids welcome to our science class. Welcome to our new topic about force, motion, and energy. Lesson 2. Explain the effects of force applied to an object. Write true if the statement is correct and write false if the statement is wrong. 1. The stronger the force exerted, the farther the toy car travels. 2. Shorter distance is traveled when force is weak. 3. When the force applied is stronger the toy car traveled nearer. 4. Longer distance is traveled when the force applied was stronger. 5. Force can change the movement of an object. You have learned from your previous lessons that force is either a push or a pull. The shape of an object changes when force is applied on it. When force is applied to an object, the size of an object may also change. In this module you will learn the effect of force on the movement of objects. The changes occur to the movements of objects when force is applied on it. What happens to an object when force is applied? Try to do the following. 1. Push your chair. 2. Pull your cabinet. 3. Open your bag. 4. Stretch a rubber band. 5. Move the table. 6. Close the door. 7. Pulling up your pants. 8. Kick a ball. 9. Lift up your bag. 10. Open the window. Force is a push or a pull. A chair cannot move from one place to another without force. When force is applied things can move. It can cause change in position of an object. When greater force is applied, the object moves faster and when lesser force is applied an object moves slower. Force can make objects move, stop, slow down or speed up a moving object. It can also change the direction of an object's movement, as well as change the size and shape of object. When a force is applied to an object or a thing, it can cause change in position. When greater force is applied, the object moves faster and when lesser force is applied an object moves slower. What I need materials, plastic toy car, meter stick, what to do, procedure, 1. Bring out all the materials needed, 2. Select a flat surface on the floor and mark a starting point using tape, 3. Gently push the toy car with your hand, observe how far it moved, measure the distance and record it to your task sheet, 4. Repeat step 3 for 5 more times. Answer the distance covered as nearer, nearest, far, farther, farthest, based on the types of force applied.
guide question 1. How do you compare the distance traveled by the toy car when you pushed it with varying strength of forces? The possible answer could be, the distance of the toy car depends on the force applied on it. The stronger the force exerted, the farther the toy car travels. Guide question 2. What factors do you think affected the movement of the toy car? The possible answer could be, one factor is the force applied to the toy car. Second, the movement of the toy car can also be affected by its weight. Guide question 3. Which degree of force applied made the toy car travel the farthest from the starting point? How about to the nearest the starting point? The possible answer could be, the toy car traveled the farthest when strongest force is applied. It is nearest to the starting point when force applied is weak or less. Complete the paragraph by choosing the correct word inside the box. Farther, lesser, greater, longer. I have learned that, the force applied to an object affect the movement of an object. The stronger the force exerted, the, blank, the toy car travels. The force applied to an object affects the object's movement. Objects with lesser mass require, blank, force for them to move to some distance, while objects with, blank, mass require greater or stronger force to make them move, blank, distance. The box is quite heavy for the delivery boys to carry. What can you suggest so that they can carry the box easier? List at least three suggestions. These are the possible answers. 1. Boys can use a ramp to easily move the box. 2. 
they can use a carrier. 3. The use of cart may also help them. What will you do if you are transferring glassware from one place to another? The possible answer could be handle the glassware properly and with care. Applying too much force on it may break the glass. 1. Which among the following object will require a greater force to move? A. Refrigerator B. Study table C. Monoblock chair D. Television Objects below require lesser force to move. A. Book. B. Notebook. C. Pencil. D. Blackboard eraser. will move more easily when a force is applied to it. A. Plastic dining table. B. Empty steel cabinet. C. Small refrigerator. D. Small wooden dining table. If a boy will have to kick one object, which one from the list below will move the farthest upon kicking? A. Soccer ball B. Basketball C. Volleyball D. Tennis ball among the objects will move faster upon the application of a force? A. Marble B. Ping pong ball C. Stone D. Beach ball Additional activity, list five objects found in your home that require greater force and five objects that require lesser force to move the object. Use the table below. <laughs> 